So you want to learn how to use this to bet on sports. I'm going to teach you everything from downloading the app, registration, getting to the casino, activating your account. This video is going to be specifically catered to the FanDuel Sportsbook at Hawthorne Racecourse in East St. Louis. Did I just say Hawthorne Racecourse? No. FanDuel Sportsbook is at the place formerly known as Fairmont Park. That's where we're going. Now, most of these steps you can use for all the other sportsbooks around the state. Barstool, DraftKings, Rivers, but the key difference is you actually have to go to those locations to activate your account so you could begin betting on sports. Now, if you have the patience, you could wait till March when the in-person registration expires. But who really has patience? If you wait till March, you're going to miss out on betting on the rest of the NFL season. You're going to miss out on betting on the Super Bowl. And come on, who doesn't want to bet on the Super Bowl? But in this video, I'm going to teach you everything that you need to know to begin placing those bets. So let's get this party started. So you probably hopped on Google and searched how to bet on sports in Illinois. Well, the simple thing to do is probably follow the steps in this video. Step one, head to the App Store and type in FanDuel Sportsbook. Then download the app. Create your email address, set up a password, then it's going to ask for a few bits of information, like your name, address, just to make sure you're located in Illinois. After that, step two, drive to the sports book. So we're about two and a half hours away from our first stop. Now, getting to the FanDuel Sportsbook is pretty easy. Uh, downtown Chicago, you just hop on I-55, head south. I usually type into Google, no tolls, hit the road. A lot of people may want to take back roads or anything, but I find it simplest to, you know, just hop on the highway, enjoy the views. There's not much to see, so I have a nice little podcast queued up. But all in all, it's about a four-hour trip uh, there for our trip back. Uh, gonna stop at a little place called the Fainting Goat, which is outside of St. Louis. But for the most part, yeah, take it easy, enjoy the drive. All right, I'm here at the Fainting Goat, uh, Pocahontas, Illinois, off of 70. Uh, great food here. We went with the onion rings and the pretzel. They do everything from street tacos to pizza to ribs to uh, crab boils. Everything's done in-house. Steaks are cut in-house. Uh, pork ribs, you name it. It's a great little spot to, to uh, stop at. Uh, scenery is good. The vibe is good. Uh, gas station's right across the street. We're about, about 30 minutes outside of Collinsville where the horse track is, where the FanDuel Sportsbook is. So right now I'm going to dive into these onion rings, dive into this pretzel, uh, enjoy this, this quick lunch, and then uh, get back on the road. Food was good, drinks were delicious, again right off the highway, about 30 minutes from the racetrack. Let's get going. Just arrived at the FanDuel Sportsbook, uh, Collinsville, Illinois, formerly Fairmont Park. Uh, if you followed all the steps of the video up till now, this is the last step in activating your FanDuel Sportsbook account. I'm gonna head indoors, uh, activate the account, and start placing bets. So let's go. When you arrive at the FanDuel Sportsbook, things are pretty easy. You walk in, head to the ticket counter, they ask for your ID and the email address that you signed up with. The whole process is pretty simple. After that, you can get ready to place your first bet. Just finished signing up. I walked in. They checked my ID. 
they verified my account via my email address that I set up, um, match that with my identification, sign my name, and now I can start placing bets on my phone. St. Louis is right across the way. I'm gonna grab a little barbecue before I head back to Chicago. Whew, what a trip, right? So, I hope you learned some good things in this video, specifically how to activate your FanDuel Sportsbook account, how to begin placing bets. As I said in the beginning, a lot of these steps you could use for other sportsbooks in Illinois. The key difference is, say you want to start betting with Bet Rivers, you'll follow the same first steps, but you have to go to the Bet Rivers Sportsbook to activate your account. We also have some really good content on Play Illinois. I'll link them down in the descriptions. They have bonuses for FanDuel, they do weekly odds, they got some really good stuff over there. If you're interested in knowing what, you know, money lines, point spreads, over-unders are, we have some really good videos on the Play USA network. I'll, you know, link up here or down in the description. If you want any more of these, hit me up in the comments. Uh, follow me on Twitter. Like, follow, subscribe. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you.